Harvest Lord? Thank you, young wizard. I don't know what I would have done had I lost him. You'd better tell the headmaster what has happened here. He needs to be informed on what's happening in Wizard City. By Bartleby, you defeated the Harvest Lord? Oh, not many students can make that claim. Good work, young wizard. The Harvest Lord mentioned that he was helping Malastare. We need to find out what Malastare's plans are if Wizard City is ever to return to the nice place it once was. It's hard to run a school with all the monsters running amok. Many thanks to you for straightening everything out on Triton Avenue, young wizard. I fear the worst is not over yet. Hey, you there. Could you give an old soldier a hand? I'm Private Quinn. They like to have their... I was planning to meet some fire elf friends here, but they didn't show up. They like to have their fun with me sometimes, but with all that's happening, would you check on them for me? Head over to Fire Globe Theatre where they live and see if they're all right. I'll wait here in case they arrive before you do. Let me guess, they were playing a prank on me. Private Quinn falls ashen when you tell him about the Fire Elf. Oh no, that's no prank. You don't know them like I do. Something horrible must have happened to the Fire Elves. Once, a Fire Elf saved my life with an arrow. His name was Phoebo. He said we'd be friends forever because their magic connects everything they touch. That's it. Bring me their arrows, and we can find out what happened to them. You'll have to duel a few of them first. Great. Thanks for doing this for the Fire Elves. If the Fire Elves are cursed or enchanted, and I bet my life they are, this arrow should reveal who did it. Greta Darkkettle used to teach alchemy at the school. She might help if you bring her the arrow. You can tell that Ambrose I'm not coming back. You explain the curse upon the Fire Elves. Greta takes the arrow you brought, then chuckles. He's a good soul, that Quinn, but what he knows about magic you probably learned your first day. I need more than this. To find out who cursed the Fire Elves, I'll need a charred knife from one of those magma men roaming the street. I'll be waiting. You got the charred knife? Excellent! This'll show the school I know what I'm doing. Greta sprinkles magic dust on the charred knife and arrow. Aha! The Fire Elves have been cursed by a banshee's whale. All you need is a lock of her hair. Talk to Private Quinn. He could prove useful. He may know of a banshee lurking nearby. 
And she's whale. That sounds like a wicked curse. Good thing you convinced Greta to help. I've received reports that a banshee is up to no good. I know who it is, too. Bastila Gravewind haunts the last tower at the very end of Firecat Alley. Defeat her in battle and snip a lock of hair from her wicked head. Greta needs that hair to save the elves. who has been undoing my work. The Fire Elves were to remain cursed until the Wizard City was in ruins! Your meddling in Malister's plans will cost you dearly, Wizard. I shall send you back to Ravenwood as an example of what happens to those who oppose us. Thank <laughs> you. 